44-year-old suspect is facing numerous charges in connection to the death of fallen state trooper Aaron Pelletier. He appeared for his arraignment. It was all done virtually via Zoom. He was in his hospital room and he had assistance from a Spanish interpreter. Now, what I can tell you is the suspect's name is Alex Oyola Sanchez. Again, he's 44 years old. He's facing a total of eight charges, among them second-degree manslaughter, operating under the influence of alcohol and or drugs and failing to move over around 2.30 Thursday. Trooper Pelletier was conducting a traffic stop when he was struck outside of his vehicle on the shoulder of the road. This happened near exit 31 on I-84 in Southington. Oyola Sanchez was driving the red pickup truck that struck Pelletier and police said left the fallen officer with fatal injuries. Police say the suspect exhibited signs of drug use when they interviewed him. Now when it comes to Oyola Sanchez's criminal history, he currently has no convictions here in Connecticut, but it's a different story in Puerto Rico where he's from. Some of the convictions he's faced there include third degree murder, attempted homicide and other felony convictions from the FBI relating to possession of firearms and controlled substances. A new Britain judge took those factors into consideration when she set his bond today. And uh, the defendant uh, is, based on these arrests has demonstrated that he is a, a safety risk to other people. And the judge ultimately set his bond today at $1.5 million. The suspect is due back in court on June 6th. In the meantime, state troopers continue to investigate, and we're here at headquarters at this hour, and you can see that the flags remain at half-staff in honor of their fallen colleague. In Middletown, Brittany Taylor, News 8.